M0 FXP Radtail RT950 Pro 10 watt model at the moment is selling for about £43 delivered to your door. Now, in my opinion, and this is my personal opinion, this is the best budget radio that I've ever used because it has VHF, UHF, airband, marine band, PMR, it goes into HF mode. It can actually be used as a CB, although you have to check in your country. It's got a triple color screen. It does APRS. I've tested APRS. It works fine. So when these first came out, I mean, the price was you know, more like £80, and that was the non-HF mode. Now they've put the HF chip in there. So uh, I just think, wow, because it says here, look, £47, okay? 47 But then it says if you click here, You'll get seven pound off if you spend more than 40 yeah so these uh, for, this is basically a shack in the box device and don't think it's low quality and the battery lasts really well i'll just go through some of these pictures actually while i'm here it's got a band scope it's got gps you can see the water uh, waterfall spectrum scope it's not DMR, but it, then if it was, it would be really complicated to set it up. Um, so I just think, wow, how are they doing? I don't know how they're doing these. And there's the frequency coverage. It does transmit 27 megs on FM. It won't transmit on upper sideband, lower sideband. It's got broadcast channels as well. You can upload photographs. How do I know you can upload a photograph? <laughs> I'll show you. Watch this. You call that Superman. And they're pretty much unlocked as you out of the box, if you ask me. Uh, not that I recommend you use them unlocked. Um, always stay legal in your country. Check your license. Check what you're allowed to do, of course, or at all times. But, um, wow, £40 for that. Um, I just... We're so lucky that the that some of these products that we're getting at these prices, even if you get it and there's a few bugs in it and there's a few little little things that you're not happy with, so what? At this price, enjoy what it does do. It's doing VHF, opening up your repeaters, no problem at all. It's quite a good antenna. If you need to buy a cable, you've probably got one. It's just the Radtel, um, the, H, the Aliens HD1 cable works. Um... Very common cables, take from me, they're £3 anyway. If you want to add one in the, into the list, into your, I don't know, your basket. <laughs> I'll put it a link in the description. But 1 million percent, get one of these for Christmas. And I must be, I don't know, Friday. Um, is it like Black Friday? Is that what it is? Bargain. And they will, I think they'll run out. And you can program this with, with an app. You can see it in the background. And they say that the app works on iPhones and android never tested it on an iphone it definitely works on um on android and then the free programming software and they just tweaked it so you can use chirp files now i'm going to test that but they will in the end because the thing about these companies they really do listen to customers that complain and if they get a lot of radio sent back it does make them go well why are they getting sent back you can message them direct you don't have to message me message them direct um, you can program this radio on the fly anyway, put it into VFO mode just by pressing the VM button, type the frequency, go into menu, and wow, what a menu, you want to see this menu, it's like um, one of the best looking menus I've ever seen, uh, if I can press the right button, look at that, look at that for the coolest, and it's it's like HD quality, and you can program every single button on here, not users every button has a long press function let's just press one that you decide what it does i'm just going to press one no i haven't set that one let's try again oh there it goes <laughs> waterfall red buttons the back and they've actually upgraded the waterfall and i need to do a video on what that works like but it, it i know that when i connect to vhf if i put an airband antenna on this and um See if I can do it now. Just select airband. You literally just like well, scanning now. Uh, back VFO mode one three three eight five zero. It might just pick it up on my rubber duck. Just got my rubber duck here. Why do we still call them rubber ducks? <sighs> so um, also, if you press the, the zero on this one, you might have to. You do pro. You can program the buttons. You've got the side buttons, of course. Big PTTs. This thing. 
It's triple PTT. One, two, three. You decide on that one. Um, and, or just press zero and it goes into a different... And it, it basically connects to a different chip. And we're now in HF. Of course, you need the right antenna. There's the programming cable on there. Bluetooth. GPS, it's got, it hasn't got a lot, but I can see a little red GPS there. Um, if I press and hold VM. Yes, this is what GPS looks like. And when you press the ABC, oh no, let's get it right. When you press the OK after you press that button, look, that's all the APRS packets it's been receiving don't listen to the gossip when people say um it doesn't work i sent it back it's full of bugs look you know and I'm, I'm not being trying to be patronizing here but learn how to use it before you send it back seven three what a bargain bye for now